how can you create the perfect ad that converts every time? So today I'm going to show you guys how to create a simple but effective ad. If you don't know by now, me and my brother, we do a lot of TikTok and a lot of Facebook advertisement. And when it comes to Facebook, we like to advertise with pictures because the product that we sell on Facebook are products that are very easy to understand, you know, like a piece of clothing or like a bag. And those products are very easy to sell on Facebook. On Facebook, you don't need those, you know, crazy product to sell. You can sell something unique, simple, that has them in, and that's it. And, you know, what I don't like about most dropshippers is they say, like, you need a flashy, boom here, boom that. No, if you look at those big brands like, you know, Fashion Nova, Nike, Adidas, Coca-Cola, they don't do something crazy when it, can, when it comes down uh, to advertisement. They keep things simple. So you need to go crazy to start making money? No, you need to keep things simple. So if you guys want to know how to create a perfect ad that will convert every time when you have a good product, obviously, if you have a product that people don't desire, even if you have the best marketing, the best ad, the best angle, then it will not work. So make sure that your product is in demand. Make sure you know that you have a good product in your hands. And then with this strategy that I'm going to show you guys, it will work tremendously well. So the product that we're going to you know, advertise today, it's going to be this, this uh, man messenger bag. And people will be like, that's it? Yeah, like product like this works amazingly well. This product sold like a ton on Facebook and it's a simple product to understand with great quality pictures and you don't need anything more. So I'm going to show you guys how do I do my creative to be able to sell something simple like that. People think like dropshipping is something like so complicated. It's not that it's complicated. When you know how to do dropshipping, when you know how to advertise properly, it's pretty simple. Obviously, I'm not saying that learning all of this is simple. Like it takes time, it takes experience, and you will become better and better. It's like a nurse that comes from school. It's she learned everything, but she needed experience. Um, and it's the same thing for every business. So it's simple to understand when you know it. But, you know, that's why you have a mentor. So he teach you what he knows. And little by little, you will gain experience and you will, you will become better. So right now we will sell this um, product uh, right here. So the way that I, it's a messenger bag. So we'll just put the initial of the product on the ad name. So uh, letter, messenger, bag, image, one. That's it. Perfect. Now uh, it's not a paid partnership with any influencer or anything like that. Uh, this is the Facebook page. You don't need an Instagram page, anything. Create an ad. Okay, perfect. Manual upload, single image. That's it. Now you want to go on add media and you want to go on add image. On here, as you can see, this image is 800 by 800. Uh, the size for Facebook is 1080 by 1080. So if you want to resize your image, like I you know, just did uh, right here, I resize those two images. Um, those two images, uh, you can resize them with Canva pretty effectively. So let's Let's wait until you know this loads uh, right here. Okay, it's uploading the messenger bag. As you can see, 1080 by 1080, we had good crisp photos. Uh, on here, what we want to do is we just want to do original. That's it. You don't need nothing more. Next, perfect. You want to do all optimization. Done. Great. So now we have this photo right here. The first thing that you want to think is, okay, what is my audience? Who am I talking to with this product? So this product would be for, let's say, photographers, for students. I think students is a is like university students. And as you can see, you know, they put a photo right here and it looks like, you know, looks like kind of a student, you know what I mean? So I think this product would be good for, for students with um, where to put their books and everything. Okay. So, and the benefits of this, it's a high quality letter vintage style bag for students. Okay. Okay. I think, I think I could do something with this. 
So you go on ChatGPT. I am selling a uh, high quality vintage letter messenger bag for men. Can you put this? Can you, let me put this right here so you guys can see. Can you give me a little uh, description? Uh, no, sales pitch, a little sales pitch, sales pitch for this product. No longer than two sentences. Elevate your style, okay? Can you can you change the elevate word and um, a timeless accessory crafted with precious and design? And can you add that it it has been crafted by hand? And only a few units have been made. And it is mostly for students. Embrace, okay. Embrace timeless style with a meticulous handcrafted vintage letter messenger bag for men, a rare gem with limited units available. Tailored for uh, this Crimson, okay. Can, okay, most, you need to understand that most people won't understand those uh, complicated words. Can you say it in a way that a fifth creator could understand? Check out this super cool, okay, make it, make it, a little bit more professional, but not too much. Discover a unique vintage letter messenger bag, meticulously crafted by hand in limited quantities. Tailored with care, this exclusive piece is suitable for students seeking a durable and stylish companion for the academic endeavors. Okay, so this, as you can see, I haven't come up with the perfect sentence right away. And I've been feeding ChatGPT to become better and better and better. And that's what you want to do. You don't want to take the first text that, that you see. You want to analyze the text and see like which one is better. So this one is great. As you can see, no emojis, no nothing to spam me. You take this and put it right here. Perfect. Great. Amazing. Okay, on here, the headline, this part right here, um, you know, the primary text will be the text up on here. And as you can see, it's pretty simple, nothing too complicated, just explaining the product. On here, you will put the offer. Obviously, on another video, I will show you how to come up with an offer. But um, right here, let's say $33. Let's say you sell it for $60, so $59.99, 50% off, something like this. So you can say to chat GPT, um, I am selling this product for 50% off. Can you give me some nice offers? Make it no longer than three to five words long and add scare city. Okay, limited time, limit, limited stock, exclusive, hurry, 50% discount. Okay, great. I like this one, put this one right here. On here, I just like to put a simple 
uh, description like letter mess men messenger bag. Okay, let's see. Give me a title for this product. The title. Okay. I think I have something. Vintage letter messenger bag. Um, make it three to five words maximum. Okay. Uh, don't add the offer into it. Just the title. Okay, timeless letter messenger bag. Amazing. You see, I have been working with ChatGPT telling me everything. Great call to action. I just like to go straight to the point right away. Shop now. You put your product page on here. You don't put your um your home page or your you know directly to the website. You you put directly to the product page right away. None. Perfect. Um, you know, here it will be website event because your pixel will be connected. So don't worry about that. So as you can see right here, you have an incredible, let me put the video right here, an incredible simple offer targeting students with a vintage letter bag, timeless letter messenger. Perfect. Hurry 50% discount. Here display URL will be your your product page. So don't worry about this. You'll put your product page here and it will change for your store name. And that's it. You don't need anything more. This is simple, easy to understand. And if people want it or want more information, they will go on your website to get more information about, let's say, what's inside, the capacity inside. Like, can I add more things? Can I add my laptop? Well, they will go on your website to look further. But that's it. You don't need anything more in order to make a great creative. Keep things simple. You see, I'm not adding like a a uh, a link here. I'm not adding uh, some emojis. Facebook don't like spammy things. Facebook has been here for a long time, so he's able to know uh, when you will get. Um, let's say, uh, he's able to know when you're a drop shipper. Like it's easy to tell if you're a dropshipper and we don't want to look like dropshippers. We don't want to look like real established brands. So we want to make things simple. You know, you see all those dropshippers getting banned on Facebook, but getting restricted. We haven't been restricted for probably years by now, I think. You know, I, I, at one point I was restricted. I'm not going to lie. I was restricted quite often. But when you understand the concept of dropshipping and the concept of actually selling something good, then like Facebook has no way to really ban you for no reason. Some cases it could happen, but overall, keep things simple, keep things sweet, professional, and that's it. That's how you will make a great offer for your products. So let me know if you have any questions down below. I will be more than happy to reply to you guys. I know I will receive a lot of questions about, you know, photos and things like that. But uh, yeah, wish you all an amazing rest of your day. Take care and peace out.